Well, hey everyone, Dwayne and Gavin here with Bronco Wild Outdoors, and uh, finally a video from in the Bronco as we're just driving. So, get out of people's way here. Uh, we're going out today just to uh, have a have a nice drive, see some cool stuff, get some pictures, and uh, see how the Bronco uh, see how the Bronco does. So, I don't know how this mount's going to do on the windshield, Gavin. I have a. Uh, little cheapy cell phone mount and, yeah, it's really shaky. and it's really shaky so the iPhone's really good about getting rid of some vibration let's see if that happens Right, check out Main Street here in Smithfield, Virginia, the historic district. Really cool place. Okay, so we're leaving Smithfield uh, and headed to Surrey. There's a few places we want to check out here today. Check out what we just saw. We're over here riding around in the Surrey, Virginia. Area 51 Bronco Sports. So I was at the intersection down here and it caught my eye. I was like, oh, Bronco Sports. So we turned left, came in here, and guess what? Just for kicks, uh, cupcakes and more. This place is awesome. Gavin just had, uh, what kind of cookies? Uh, chocolate chip, and you had a... The, well, I haven't had them yet, but it's the uh, white chocolate macadamia. So yeah. the, it smells great inside, by the way. So when you're in this area, if you're had, heading over to the uh, ferry to go to Jamestown, or if you're just traveling from Smithfield through western part of Virginia, uh, definitely come by here, uh, stop in Surrey. We're right here where uh, 31 and 10 meet. So Route 31 and 10, and check it out. This is awesome. Bronco Sport. Got just for kicks there on it. And Gavin, here we are. We're in our Bronco. We're checking it out. And pretty cool, right? Yeah. So how many sports have we seen so far? Uh, this, this right here would be our eighth sport. All right, so this is number eight. Let me count them. Ooh, look at that. Gavin, I can still use that. Number eight. So pretty cool. Bronco Sports, a very popular vehicle. And uh, here we are. So look, come check out uh, Just for Kicks. 
cupcakes and more. The place smells wonderful inside and highly, highly recommended. Alrighty, so we are pulling here at, what is that, Smith Fort? Lane. Yeah, we're on Smith Fort Lane, and we're headed to, I guess, Smith Fort here in Surrey, Virginia. What a nice drive through here. We actually just saw a deer. I was hoping he'd run across the road and, uh, up, you know, ahead of us a little bit so you could see it, but uh, a deer being a deer, it's, uh, you know, skittish knows where to go right hey get these flowers over here guys you actually have them on your side over here too some nice colors out here in the uh in the fall right Check this place out. Well, this is pretty awesome. driveway we're headed down this place is uh it's a beautiful place i wonder how much land they have here guys yeah me too i don't know so like i said earlier we've been riding around several hours country roads we were going to do a ferry today but um it's uh the there's a couple ferries, and one of them is down, struck by lightning the other day, and um, traffic's backed up, so we're not going to do that. We don't want to sit in traffic all day. So we've been riding around. I had a great lunch at a little mom and pop's place called Virginia Diner. I say little. It's pretty. It's a pretty big place, wouldn't you say, Gavin? Yeah. And there's Bacon's Castle. Wow. And what do you guys see? <clears throat> see this building. So Gavin and I are checking out the grounds here at Bacon's Castle in Surrey, Virginia. Uh, 
we were just talking the original part of the house which is going to be hard to tell from this angle with the sun it was built in the early or mid 1600s and then the addition uh the other part of that which i'll show you in a few minutes was built in the 1800s so it's funny how they say the newer addition <laughs> uh man that was a long time ago but uh this building right here was the smokehouse and this one right here was the slave and tenant house. So obviously this place goes way back to um, a different different time in America. So uh, I don't know what this building was. Maybe another one of these. Um, but I do know that this right here is the smokehouse. And being this close to Smithfield, Virginia, you know they, they knew how to do the, uh, do the hams. So... Place. It's kind of hard to tell. Video is not going to show it. There's a breeze, low low 60s today. Very quiet out here with the occasional hot rod on the main road behind us. Uh, but with the wind blowing through this place, through the buildings, um, man, it's just tremendous. Just the history here. Uh, it's just amazing. So you have a bunch of laughing over here. I have no idea what that is. I'm glad they're laughing though. Um, but it's pretty cool. You get to walk around the grounds here. The bars on the windows. I don't know when they were added. Someone could tell us at some point in time. But you know, uh, there again, Gavin and I, we're out today enjoying the enjoying the day in our Ford Bronco. And uh, this is the kind of stuff that the Bronco gives us to, huh, Gavin? Yeah. So this, I think this might have been a jail or prison. Because it had those boarded windows. Yeah, I don't know. I, don't know I hope not. <laughs> um, look at this view behind me here. Whoa, man. All I mean, this place is just incredible. And look. See our Bronco. Man. Places. This cool. And they're doing some kind of undercutting the trees back that way. Can't, I don't think you'll be able to see, but trees back over there. They're thinning the uh, the underbrush, which is something that's not a bad idea to do. It cuts down on on fires. Stuff gets out of control. Is this a stall or something? This is a barn. Yeah, it looks like stalls. But why the floor in here? Hmm. I don't know. There might have been a little This ramp. is a tobacco barn? Uh, no, it's just 1701 barn. Oh. And there might have been little ramps to go up. Because there'll be a little. This barn. is like. So we would have. Okay, this is where they had their beams, the little square holes right here. This is where their beams went across. And that's how the beam, beam pocket, there's another name for it, I'm drawing a blank. But if I was doing something masonry wise, it would be called a beam pop. Now this right here is a piece of treated lumber. Obviously that one's been, uh, been redone. Um, that was fairly new. This is treated, so this is fairly new. And that's a big chunk of lumber, by the way. Yeah. So this out here being the end where it is probably had a uh, uh, a lot of a lot more water in it rain maybe the roof leaked at one point in time i mean this is exposed to the weather and this is original so who knows Let's see if we can figure this out here i don't know if you're gonna be able to see that so okay pretty cool i love history so get a chance you're in the uh southeastern virginia we're actually in surrey virginia uh check out bacon's castle place is pretty cool uh they do have a guided tour check their website for uh the hours we got here before they physically closed but we missed the last uh tour uh by about 20 minutes so we're gonna come back next time and hopefully get some video from the inside for you but this is uh Dwayne and mr gavin here filming some and we're out enjoying the outdoors with our Bronco and part of Bronco Wild Outdoors. This is, uh, if you're not looking for hard Bronco content, this is a different playlist. And this is when we get 
uh, go out and see cool stuff. So welcome to uh, the adventures. They're starting. So we'll get some more video next time. We won't be late. You know, we just yeah. tighten up, bro. You didn't have to eat at Virginia Diner, then we could have made it. It was fun though. I'm glad. I'm glad you talked me into going there. Yeah. So it's pretty cool. So hey, check out. Look it up. Bacon's Castle, right here in Surrey, Virginia. See you guys later. Bye. And look at this barn behind me here. Check this out. It's pretty cool. See the ladder? It had a ladder right here. It went up. Um, and I guess they would just swing over into that loft right there. That loft door. Uh, this barn here, just like all the other structures out here, is old. I don't know how old it is, but you can see this um, covered, I don't know if it's a barn, just a covered area, um, like a glorified shed. <laughs> you can see they had different stalls here. No telling what was in there. I think with this much land here, any number of things, equipment, uh, stuff like that. Of course, they have modern day stuff out here but uh this place is really wild i'm gonna do a little 360 here so you can see it a lot of land here see ya. Driving around in the Bronco, we stopped at a place called Bacon's Castle, and I know the name's a little funny. And there's a lot of play. This or the original house, and I guess this all this stuff was built with the original house. So I'm gonna go over here. So this is selfie, and so what you're gonna see is of course maybe an outhouse or electrical house and this is the smokehouse this tall building right here this is where they kept the meat this is where they kept the meat cool cooked it so and then there's a thing right here see the smokehouse By the way, this is in here. So, I have to make this quick, but, so, see this whole left half right there? All this was built on in the late 1800s, but this half was built the early 1600s so this is the house and I'll get a front view so there we got a little water pump over there I don't know if you can see it's ri right there so that's that and then I'm gonna go around here 
sorry, my dad's over here. I need to get over there quick, so I'm just gonna jog a little bit. Alrighty, so Gavin and I are headed home from our um, exciting day of riding around here southeastern Virginia. So let's see, we went, uh, Gavin, to Suffolk, we went to Surrey, uh, a few small towns through Smithfield, um, we went to Bacon's Castle, which is in Surrey, and you got a book, what are you reading? Oh, man, Haunted Stories. Haunted Stories of what? Haunted Stories of Virginia. So we got that at Bacon's Castle. We also got two of uh, the recorders, you know, the recorders you play. I hope you liked today, the video um, that we put together. So, hey, if you haven't already, like and subscribe and uh, turn on post notifications, hit that little bell so you know when we drop a video or when we go live or when kind of anything really happens over here at Bronco Wild Outdoors. And Gavin and I look forward to talking to you soon.